Hi guys, this is Ashish from Technosper.net and today I'll be talking about an online tool that's called as ImageMaps.com and this ImageMaps.com help us to create an image mapping tool. Now in simple words, if we image map is a, la is a big map where you have certain parts of that image made clickable. So let's say if you want to put a image background on a, on your website and you want some of the parts to be clickable like subscribe to Twitter, or subscribe to uh, Facebook, whatever you want uh, and you want only those parts to be clickable you can do that. So let's begin with a sample head I already have. We'll start mapping your images. It gives a support banner kind of stuff here where they ask for support we can very well skip this you can see the image is already uploaded it's pretty fast and now this is the tool now like you can see the image is already here and I'll be making certain parts clickable and even if you have a rectangle or a different shape it supports it so if you want you can have rectangular shapes, icons and all them make clickable. That's not a problem at all. So what we'll select, we don't want the base URL. We don't want the show text links. And let's leave allow backlink for now. And we'll select rectangle. And that's where it came. We'll just adjust it according to our need. And we'll say... Technospot.net title as Technospot. We'll say save. So this part is done. Now I'll again click rectangle and this time we'll move to a smaller icon. I'll just make sure it's. Don't make it too big. Don't make it too small. Close so that you have everything in place and we'll say Facebook fan page save similarly we'll make it for uh, it remembers the size of the last rectangle you made so if you have couple of images of more or less same size you can map them together in a row Follow us on Twitter. Also save and again click on rectangle. We'll come here. Log. I'm not sure. Okay, it worked now. Now we'll add this link and we'll say subscribe to Google Reader. I'll say save. Done this. Now let's see a couple of options which you have. Like uh, you can have, you can so show show text links. So this is when it comes. So what happens if somebody is browsing from mobile, and uh, if the website doesn't have a mobile support, still the text link comes. So that's one benefit if you want to do it. We'll just leave the allow back link because I have seen it's not working without that. And uh, done this. I'll say okay. One thing you should notice is. You get to know the full detail of any map link which you have created. Like you can see how the coordinates are. You can see these coordinates. And now let's say get your code. Let's we'll go to HTML code. Copy this. You have option of CSS code also if you want. We'll just have now here you can see it's all made clickable. So what we'll do is we'll co we copied that code. Now I'll come here. Now since we said allow backlink, it'll add at the end a uh, link back to its image map. If you want, you can delete it. And now the important thing you should notice here is uh, this is your every image is given an ID. And it uses a HTML tag called as use map, which again has an ID. Now the ID which is here, 
is again here so make sure if you change it to your IDs if you want to put your own IDs this should to match and keep the same format that's how I would recommend and your images and all is ready now we'll save this save a copy as we'll go desktop and we'll say oh my header dot html and save it and we'll go to okay now we'll open up the my header now if you can see it's linked to the website it's linked to the twitter it's linked to the google reader this is how everything works so please remember this tool it's a very excellent tool which you can use and if you want you can go back to edit map say ok to load it back and see if there are any errors save it say get your code and you come back here with your code available here so that's how it works I hope you like this tool and if you want to create a image map anytime use this tool and if you want to donate help these people thanks for watching thanks a lot